What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is me again, the Crypto Nico, and today let's talk about some Shiba in you and what the game is doing and why is it so cool? Why is it significant? What? The, just come on. Why are we loving this thing? <laughs> but before we do, uh, you already know, hit that subscribe button, like, share this out everywhere you can. We want to keep on getting the news out to you uh, best we can, right? So that being said, let's see what let's see what Shiba is doing. What Shiba is doing today? All right, today is September twenty sixth, and uh, it's Monday. And it seems like uh, yeah, there was a bit of a pullback from the twenty fourth um, all the way down to the twenty sixth. So um, you know, kind of a natural correction kind of situation going on and then in comparison to to bitcoin the same thing occurred as we've mentioned many times on this channel these two are pretty correlated in their price action but it is what it is right um a little bit of a pump going on though a little bit of a pump so you know people are buying people are buying um yeah that, that's going up <laughs> imagine it goes like all the way up here <laughs> It's a possibility. There's a lot of uh, whales out there that are accumulating uh, Shiba, Bone, and you know anything that's within the Shiba ecosystem. So it's pretty cool. Anyway, all right. So that goes uh, that that goes it for the sh the chart today. Um, now let's go to Nomics.com and see what the entire market's doing. Now the entire market is red. A lot. Uh, yeah, just all red. Negative one, negative four, negative two, negative three percent. Terra Luna is defying all the odds, or Terra Luna Classic actually, defying all the odds of what's actually occurring um, macro-wise with all the markets. Very interesting that that is pumping. Um, didn't expect that, but hey, you never know. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, the rest of the, uh, the market is just it's looking red. Um, you know, macroeconomics plays a big role. We're in a bear market. Brace yourselves. <laughs> anyway, all right. So that go that goes it, or that that's it for the uh, the general market. Uh, now let's look at what the news is for Shiba Inu. So the game Shiba Eternal, right? That's what it is. Shiba Eternal um, gets a four point five a uh, four four point nine rating out of five on the App Store. So, I'm sorry, it should, it should be Eternity, that's what I meant to say. Um, it is a card game that is on the App Store right now. It has been released only in three countries and already has a 4.9 rating, which means that this game is easily becoming a huge success. Now, one thing that this game has promised this game has promised a 5% burn of all that it makes on its store. So as people, you know, operate within the game, as people do things within the game, um, anything that is collected, it will turn into a 5% burn. So it having such a high rating on the App Store, it just goes to show that it definitely could be something that will make, you know, um, Shiba Inu pretty viral to the masses. Um, it's only available right now in Vietnam, Indonesia, and Australia. But I think it's going to do a worldwide release. Actually, it will do a worldwide release on October 1st. So literally right around the corner, you're going to see Shiba Inu possibly have a pump because this thing is highly anticipated people want it in their countries there's a lot of hype generated around this game it's a card game known for a huge market you know a lot of people when they when they engage in video games such as card games people become extreme fanatics like i mean they buy the cards they, they wait in huge lines to get into the card you know to get the cards from different stores and then when they obtain certain things of the cards well now they feel like they have something of value and you know then they operate in the ecosystem they trade i mean that's why pokemon cards was so big right and this very well has the opportunity to be just as big as a pokemon card game or other 
right? I mean, Battle.net, I, I think Blizzard has its own card game. And uh, if, if this becomes as big as that card game, wow, that would be something extremely spectacular to watch. Anyway, I am the Crypto Nico. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like, it, share it out everywhere you can. We're here bringing you the news every single day. Make sure you stay tuned, and we'll catch you the next one. Take care.